So Maine Poor People's Campaign here. We have been here in Maine since 2018 when the national campaign revived. This, this is a revival of Martin Luther King and the movement ancestors before us in 1968. Reverend Dr. Martin Luther King connected things. He said that we will never end racism unless we also end militarism, unless we also end poverty. And the campaign today also has added that we will not end all of those unless we also end ecological devastation. And if we do not end this distorted moral narrative that we live in today in this country. And so the campaign has existed here in Maine for three years. We are a movement, not an organization. We are a movement that is building power. We stood on the steps in Maine at the Blaine House and people were arrested in 2018 and were arrested not just in Maine, but in capitals across this nation in the largest mass demonstration of civil disobedience that this century has seen thus far. Because people are coming together because we are sick and tired of racism, of poverty, of militarism, of ecological devastation and a distorted moral narrative. We took a truth and poverty tour around Maine, listening to people who are the most impacted by these systemic evils. And we then, uh, and we have been organizing grassroots around the state of Maine since then, using big events like when the national co-chairs came to visit in Maine. Um, and marched down the streets and shut down Portland briefly. And we had our first national, we sent people from Maine down to the National People's Congress in 2019, of which there will be another. Last year we had a mass digital gathering that we organized together here in Maine. It was going to be in person, but if, if COVID had not happened, we would have not reached the almost three million people nationwide to build this movement. And now we are asking everyone to join us in building this movement here in Maine. We are building towards next Monday when we announce that um, there will be a resolution put forward in Congress by the Poor People's Campaign to end poverty. And we cannot end poverty without the ending those other evils. And so we are building a movement and I have and when you build a movement, you can't have one speaker in the movement. We have, there are multiple of us who will speak to what this movement is and does. So I think I am passing it to Josh.